What's up guys, welcome back to our channel, where today we'll discuss the best travel headphones for 2023, according to their performance, budget, value, and more. Check out the description for the latest prices and information. There are two companies that dominate wireless noise canceling headphones, Bose and Sony. For every benchmark from Bose, there's a Sony lurking in the shadows when it comes to bulky wireless noise canceling headphones aimed at business travelers. The newest of the lot, Sony's WH-1000XM5, announced in 2022, comes with several useful upgrades over the XM4 that are perfect for travelers. They still boast market leading noise canceling, but now have Bluetooth 5.2 for wireless connectivity and USC PD chargings so a mere three minutes of charging can last for three hours of playback. That's perfect if you're just about to go on a long haul flight and need a quick juice up. The ANC itself is adaptive, relating to your circumstances. The XM5 will learn about your most commonly visited location and can adapt itself to suit. While the Sony WH-1000 XM5 doesn't come cheap itself, in some review, the users found the combinations of Sonic Fidelity, a top-tier active noise cancellation, which is flawless, and that comes in competitive battery life, and that is impeccable eco-credentials. These are hands down the best headphones for travel. The Bose QC35 and QC35 II were an icon of travel headphones that catch any rush hour train and board any flight, and you'll see black and silver Bose headphones peeking out from the top of almost every headrest. Now, there's a new model available. The literally named Bose Noise Cancelling Headphones 700 introduces a sleek new design that are both lightweight and elegant to its core. Behind the smart looks, the headphones still pack 11 adjustable levels of top-notch noise cancellations, impressive audio qualities, and up to 20 hours of wireless battery life. Like many of today's headphones, either Alexa or Google Assistant can be summoned with a button. And padded angled ear cup are designed to put comfort first and foremost. The headphones may be quite expensive, but it's well worth its price to have headphones that can last around 20 hours on a single charge and have a Bluetooth range of 30 feet. Remember that these are not the best headphones for rapid movements like working out. They're comfortable, but they're unlikely to stay on your head if you're doing a rigorous activity. Bowers & Wilkins PX7 is the outstanding product on which B&W built a global reputation. It combines all their hard-won expertises and audio manufacturers with cutting-edge noise cancellations and looks stunning. The headphones sound excellent, with BMW's usual exciting but well-balanced signature sound. In fact, they sound a lot better than the other big-ticket noise-canceling headphones. The PX7 also features motion sensing, which means if you lift the cups to your ear, the sound is being paused. If you take them off entirely, they go into standby mode. We found that's very useful when traveling, as you'll need to remove them to talk to people. If you're a Sony fan but need portability from your carry-on earphones, then the WF-1000XM4 are just right for you. Sony has claimed these tiny earphones give improvements in every areas, including noise cancellation, over their predecessors while still maintaining a compact design and pocket-sized charge case. Battery life is around 8 hours for the earphones themselves, longer than Apple's AirPod Pro model, and up to 24 hours when you top them up when using the charging case. The Sony WF-1000XM4 sounds just about right for the price point, though there are some quirks that you need to tinker a bit with to get the sound that you want. In general, the foam ear tips guarantee a good seal, meaning that not only are they able to prevent a lot of outside noise from affecting your tunes, but it's easier to get the best performance possible. The Sony WF-1000XM4 has a decent mic, but it suffers a little bit over AAC. It's perfectly fine for phone calls though. There are also features that will detect when you speak to help the mic determine what sound you want it to boost and what's just noise. It's a useful feature, albeit one you may notice less, but that's really the point that Sony doesn't want you to think about this sort of thing. It just wants the audio to be decent. It may not be as exciting, but with a little cash to burn, we'll find the older model a trusty. However, the Sony WF-1000XM4 is a better performer in just about every way. Apple AirPods were a game changer when they were first released in the market, 
and it's no surprise that people still use to travel with it today. These simple earbuds have three simple tips to fit different ear sizes and are sweat and water resistant as well. By simply touching or pressing the AirPod Pro's earbud a few times, you can change the songs, pause, play, or turn on transparency mode to hear the world around you. Regarding battery life, the AirPod Pro can hold up to four and a half hours of listening time on a single charge, and only three and a half hours if you're talking the entire time, and that's with active noise cancellation and transparency. Compared to others on this list, that's not a lot of battery life itself, but with the wireless charge cases, you can get an 18 additional hours of talk time and 24 hours of listening time, but you'll need to charge the pause a few times. Five minutes in the case provides an hour of battery life. Connecting is super simple for Apple users, and Siri can help with notifications, making calls, or even changing songs. Android users won't be able to use Siri, and they'll need to take a few more steps to connect the earbuds to their devices. The H95 are available in a light and dark color scheme. The cables are textile coated and slightly short, around 1.2 meters, while the ear pads are made of the finest lamb's leather and are lined with memory foam. They can be removed with a magnetic closure and can also be replaced. The underside of the headband is textile covered, and the upper side is finished with leather. The right wheel controls the volume, the left controls the adaptive noise cancelling. Instead of wiping gestures, controlling the volume via the wheel is a very pleasant operation, but you can also control the transparency mode or the strength of the noise cancelling with one finger, which is extremely practical. Then there is a small button on the left side near your earlobe to call up the voice assistant of your choice, which works without any problems on iOS as well as on Android. On the right ear cup is another button to switch on and pair the H95. The folding mechanism is also very nicely designed. You can fold the H95 in an origami style, making them easy to carry in your hand luggage or the included aluminum case. It has good sound, great appearance, and high functionality, especially due to the good controls on the headphones themselves, very good battery performance and stylish materials that don't make up the mediocre noise cancelling, and a price that could have been a third lower. Thank you for watching. If you like this video and want to hear more from us, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get notified of our new videos.